Alright, what's going on guys? It's Robert Welkin here of CoinUp TV. I got Ninja Gaiden 3 in my hands, PlayStation 3. And the uh, game just came out today. And I'm giving it a whirl on the single player campaign. You could jump, you're a ninja, it's bloody, do some easy attacks or quick attacks on the square, triangle, do a harder attack. And uh, by pushing down on the right thumbstick there, it'll show me which direction I need to go. This is fairly early in the game. I just took out, took out some bad guys and a little bit of a boss battle. And I uh, just want to kind of jump in, get some plant gameplay going there. Oh, dude on fire. I kill you while you're on fire? <laughs> it's not showing my health gauge in the uh, upper left there, so I guess that, that wouldn't have killed me the fire. Alright, so here's your basic goons that need to be slashed and dashed. Guys, if you're not into blood and violence, then uh, now's a good time to go to a different video on my CoinFTV YouTube channel. Because uh, for the next 10 15 minutes, I'm going to see some ninja gore. And hopefully, lots of deaths on the bad guys, and not so much me. I make no claim to be an amazing Ninja Gaiden player. But you guys are familiar with the license and title past. It's been it's action paced, generally hard, and difficult. A lot of button mashing to be done. Oh no, shield guy! Shield guys are a little tricky. You gotta slide around like behind them or. Uh, press circle, shoot stars. Uh, as far as I know, the shurikens are unlimited. So, I'm just tossing those out whenever I get a little break in the action. Actually useful to spot enemies when they're approaching, because generally the shurikens will auto-target for you. And uh, you can sort of block and parry. Uh, the sliding is also the same command as the block. So a lot of times, if you, if you just hold down the left left one, L1, uh, this guy's getting a little crazy. It's hard to demonstrate while, while getting crazily attacked by bad marine dudes. I need a little health potion here. I don't want to die. So I guess the, the thought is to uh, sort of block and parry when guys attack you, but it's a little... See, here's blocking. Ah, well, it seem to be... Blocking timing's a little wanky for me. I haven't figured it out yet. Alright, well, they didn't kill me. I got my health back. That's good. So, uh, you know, you get these little mini, mini battles there along the way. And most of the game has just been sort of running through the city. There was a little... There's a little climbing level earlier. There's some climbing. Whoa! Toss a little star up there. This kind of stuff totally reminds me of God of War. I like this animation and uh, using the right and left uh, shoulder pads there to get up. It's pretty cool. Uh, a lot of the levels are kind of limited, you know, it's not like really free roaming, like, you know, it looks like I should be able to hop over this fence. I'm a ninja and I'm hitting an invisible wall right there, so that's a little bit of drag, it's very linear. In fact, there's a lot of levels where you can't even control the camera at all. I guess I'm just meant to go in this door. Something to grab? No. So that's uh, sort of a drag too. Sometimes you're like, you know, well, hey, I, you know, I want to control the camera, but I can't. So it kind of harkens back to some old school gaming where you know it's kind of half gate, half camera control, and not all the time. You know, this ninja guide is sort of like a. Do you know where the hostages are being held? No, we can't monitor anything inside the residence. Watch yourself, Hayabusa. 
Uh, so yeah, the you know these games derived from old school games, they they still kind of carry over a little. See, like right here, I can't control the camera, so they kind of carry over a little old school <laughs> platforming elements, kind of like Devil May Cry, where you didn't really have camera control. I'm assuming the new Devil May Cry DMC that comes out will let you control the camera. I mean, it's strange. I cannot move left or right. So, whoa. <laughs> There's a little surprise there. Hey, Lusar, are you okay? And these soldiers have now, been now the camera's well. back. A giant hero. spider tank earlier too. Get Who my are hero shot people? going here. Have they made any demands? No, not yet. Other than calling for you, that is. <laughs> I think we can do away with like when people are talking on walkie-talkies and radios. They don't need to hold their hands up to their ear anymore. I think. I think we get it that you're talking and there's somebody who can hear you or vice versa in your earpiece under your little ninja scarf. Hayabusa, what's wrong? Oh. There's blood. Are the hostages already? I'm going on. Gosh, Hayabusa's so intense. He's passionate, needs to find these hostages. Guys, when the story that started this off, the cutscene and the intro was <laughs> very small, so I don't really know a heck of a lot about these hostages. They just kind of drop you into the game, give you a little bit of a tutorial as you go. The executive so. office is up ahead. You're finished! A lot of these uh, surprise attack dudes popping out. Alright, I got the camera back, so I wish there was a little bit of an icon, you know, something that kind of said like, Hey, you no longer have use of your camera, and now you do have use of your camera. You're finished. You go, you're finished. It's a little tricky here, I'm in uh, close quarters, you know, ninjas. Us ninjas, we, we like to be able to get out of here, you know. Hide shadows, not not fight out in the open like this, right? I uh, recently played some Naruto gameplay for my Coin of TV channel. My buddy Matt was helping me with that, showing off some of his ninja skills. Alright, so far so good. A lot of button mashing here. I'm just mainly pressing square and triangle every once in a while. Uh, and I guess the most tactical thing to do is figure out when you want to slide, not slide, and then every once in a while toss toss a star shuriken. Uh, this little dove, this little with the bird heel, let me save. Thanks, bro. So that's how you save in the game. There's a little saving icon. I'm not seeing any little collectibles or anything just off out of my vision there, off screen. See if we can save a hostage. Please help! Please just Oh no. Oh no. I've been waiting for you, hero. Who are you? Let's dispense with the introductions and get straight to the killing. Whoa. Shall we? Come, Ryu. The fan of the opera mask. Uh okay. I got quick time moments here. Oh, you can't just show me like one, one, one thing, and then nothing else. Do I do any damage to you? Where's your health, bro? Seems like you blocked my shuriken attack. There we go. I'm digging this this crazy music coming up here. Whoa! I'm getting crazy stabbed. My my health replenish if I run away. Where's my where's my health meter bomb? Where's my uh? I'm trying to press things on the D-pad here. See if I have any health vials or anything. That's it. Dead. It's a good thing that little bird was outside. I get to save the game. All right, so now you get to see if I if I if I've improved at all here. 
So, uh, left one is block. Let's see, the thing is, if I press the direction on the joystick, then I'll slide. I kinda wish that was, like, two different buttons there. I have no idea what kind of health this guy has. Trying to, I'm trying to block there. You know, God of War, you can kind of like time the blocking so you can uh, counter. There's <laughs> a lot of button mashing going on at the moment. <laughs> As you can see, I, I'm dying. I really love games that actually make you feel like you're doing something and not just button mashing. Seems like, uh... Seems like there's a lot. I'm just gonna die here. Kill me. Just throw it from scratch. <laughs> actually seems to be uh, taking a longer time to kill me when I'm there. I put my back on you. Let's start from the scratch again here. <laughs> it's not the cool thing if you ninja to... Slice in the back Come, like that. Ryu okay, I'm holding down L. Blocking. Ow. Oh. Did that hurt him? Where's your health, young? Seems like he's got a 2-2... Two, two Attack. This is great. You guys are watching me trying to figure out how to fight while I attempt to do audio commentary. I actually find that I'm a better gamer when I'm not doing audio commentary. Unfortunately, there's no proof of that because the only time you get to see. That doesn't seem to be doing anything. He's not even blocking. Well, there's no proof of when I'm actually doing good, kicking ass in a game. Alright, well, this boss battle may... I have to go and level up or something. Left? I want to evade strong attacks. Alright, I am trying to evade strong attacks. How do I know when he's strong attacking, though? It's not like he makes a sound or anything. Come on, give me some help. Rise again. Start with a different playstyle. Hmm. That was on normal. Hero. Hmm. Yes, let's rise again. What is hero? Do? Come, Ryu Hayabusa. Is this any easier, playing on hero mode? I feel like I'm getting my blocks and parries in there in time. Well, he seems to be kicking my ass less, so... Maybe, maybe hero mode's easier. My screen is going so dark there. Let's get some ninja ninja magic there. Some of these little quick time moment things happen so quickly. It's hard to tell like what the heck, you know, like as you're fighting. Alright, now I don't have any control of my camera. 
Let's see, where's where's the little icon that tells me that? It, you know, kind of takes like a few seconds to readjust when you have control of the camera or not. Game developers, you might have wanted to think about that when you were making this. Just a little bit of a sound effect, or a little, a little something on the screen. So once, I feel like, you know, once you lose control of the camera, then it just kind of becomes a little more button mashy. It's like, alright, tapping X and triangle, and... Controlling less of my environment. Alright, so hero mode must be substantially easier, unless I just got way better. Open your eyes, Ryu Hayabusa! <laughs> Let's see, hero, fight enemies and save the day. Best for those with occasional play action games, alright? So normal is, uh... Best for those who enjoy the action games, and then hard was, uh, test your skills. So, how does it feel <laughs> to suffer as all of your victims? Uh, it feels amazing. Am I... Is there a button I need to push here to, to answer? Oh, well, I press no, no. square. We are both steeped in the blood of our countless victims, my brother. Farewell until we meet again. Oh no, there's a ghost. I was killed by a ghost. I'm fine. I don't look very fine. Listen, radar has picked up a missile incoming. One minute to impact. You I'm need walking. to get out of there. I'm walking as fast as I can, lady. Don't slow me down, man. There's gotta be a way out somewhere. Let's see if I can get the camera. I can't get the camera around. I can only go halfway around. I'm trying to show my face in agony. Very interesting. So far, I'm digging this game, but, man, not being able to control the camera every once in a while, randomly, and half, half camera, is a little bit of a drag on my point. How disappointing. <laughs> I'd hoped the mighty dragon ninja would have put on more of a show. Uh, no matter. Begin the next phase. Yes, sir. Sir. This is the beginning of the end of the world. <laughs> wow. It's like crazy alien Hayabusa! dudes or something. Can you hear me? Oh, I'm still alive, Hayabusa! I hear you. Come in. Hayabusa? Yeah. We're coming to pick you up. Good. All right. Do I get a trophy? Have I, have I eclipsed a level? I think I may wrap this up after the cutscene here. Don't worry about it. What matters now is... What's the situation? The soldiers withdrew once the residence was destroyed. It appears you really were their objective. Mizuki, turn on the news. This new world has no need of nation-states. No need of avaricious, incompetent prime ministers, or presidents, or kings, or despots. Every nation, every country, must immediately agree to our terms of surrender. You have seven days. Exactly the number of days it took God to create the world. Failure to comply will result in your immediate destruction. We did it to London, and we can do it to you. So this is what they were really after. All right, epic. There we go. The grip of murder. Well, that's cool. At least it'll let me change to my uh, my 
fighting style after I got to things. I think I'm going to wrap this, this video up for now. It was Ninja Gaiden 3. I was playing it on the PlayStation 3, but it's also available on the Xbox 360. It's out now. It's uh, March 20th, 2012 was the release date. Uh, as you can see, there's some campaign mode, story mode that I was playing, but there's also want to mention that you can play up to eight players, multiplayer online. There's like clan battle stuff and um, lots of multiplayer action, which is sort of new to this franchise from from what I understand. And uh, so, uh, you know, eventually I'm going to have to get on, play some multiplayer and check it out. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed watching me, uh, watching me get destroyed there and having to go down to a lower level. I, I, I feel bad. I haven't done that in a, quite a while. Usually I can kind of stick on normal mode, but, you know, I was getting all distracted with the camera and the controls and wanting to move on so you could see the cutscene there. So uh, for CoinApp TV, this has been Robert Welkner. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you leave a comment even if you want to troll the heck out of me because I died a few times. It's okay, man, because I'm sure you're the most amazing Ninja Gaiden player out there, and I will look forward to any tips or any uh, ninja skills you want to share with me. And uh, make sure to subscribe to my channel. It's youtube.com slash coinapptv. Thanks a bunch for watching. We'll see you next time.